Hi again, I'm back. Uh, getting to the second phase, a little quicker than I expected. Um, just kind of felt like I kept going. Now, I won't build this ramp, probably for five years or ten years, I don't know, whenever the need finally shows up. But it's kind of going to be ready for the ramp. And uh, I guess I'm going by the, uh, if you build it, it will come. And I don't need any uh, wheelchairs in my life showing up anytime soon, so I won't build it yet. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and build this, take these steps off first, move them down there, and then start building this thing. Um, I'm going to be accommodating, see this big rock here is going to have a adobe uh, pizza oven, kind of bread oven, stove kind of thing, oven thing. I'm going to have that up there. That's going to be, I'm really looking forward to that. I think that's probably what's driving me to get the second phase going, because I was like, wow, I really, I've been excited about this thing for many, many years. I've been wanting one of these things, so finally happened. All right, we'll catch up later.
Well, it's at the end of day one, and this is the progress that I made. We can see it just from different angles. I know we just saw. A little tricky getting all these uh, angles. The 45 degrees are fine, but by the time this section here was the same angle as the ramp, and the ramp is a bit askew. So all this is uh, the same skewed angle. Um, and then this is where the uh, Adobe stove is going to go, the pizza oven. So that'll be fun. And there's going to be a little roof over the oven as well. All right, that's it for the day. We'll do all the slats um, tomorrow, probably. And they'll be at a 45 as well, perpendicular to these 45s. So I think that'll be real nice to have all these slightly different angles of the, of the boards. They look really good. All right, ready for tomorrow.
I think I've got about as much of this deck done as I can do at this point. We've got phase two almost finished. Just a thing or two that might be lacking. Um, and I'll show you when I get there. But anyway, so yeah, here's the uh, main entry from the driveway parking area. Nice, not too wide, not too narrow set of steps. They're super sturdy. Oh, I walked past the main feature for this whole thing. This is where the ramp one day is going to show up. I'll go down there. There'll be a platform down at that end. Do a U-turn and then land right there. So it should work out really well. Um, I'm not building that thing till I'm in a wheelchair. Of course, that might be fun, but I'll do it. All right, so this was phase one that we'd already seen most of. I added a... Uh, bench. Real convenient place to sit. Okay, and then this is the uh, phase two. Got a nice little step down there. A nice size. And this of course as I'm sure you guessed is where the pizza oven is going to go. The adobe wood-fired oven. And it's got a little nice little roof on it to help protect it from the rain. And I'm thinking of doing some shelf work just kind of mirroring the bottom angle up here, so, you know, so when I'm putting things in and out of this oven, I've got space to set things on. So I'm going to probably go there and then have this oven over here, something like that, you know, whatever. Anyway, there's the big foundation rock, footer rock, whatever like that. That's going to be kind of leveled, but quite immovable. And then these are the set of steps that I built. Um, this goes down to the compost station as well as to the right it goes down hiking trails to the creek and some cliffs and cool stuff and uh, this goes well eventually I'll extend the stairs and that's where the gardens are in a whole front space but we'll show you what these steps kind of are looking like from this angle So I'm really pleased with how it turned out. Those steps, those double wanky funny angled steps, that cooked to my goose for a little while, getting all those angles and math figured out. All right, I guess I just gotta clean up, clean up, and start, uh, I'm gonna start uh, building the foundation for this, the base, and then coming up with a space to store wood underneath, and then the stove, the oven itself is gonna be up at uh, about three foot up. All right, well, that sounds fun. Catch you later. Oh, and uh, I failed to mention the things that I might still be lacking. Um, I'm probably definitely going to be having some kind of a handrail down the left side. I, I just don't have the material anymore. I didn't really know exactly how this was going to play out, where these steps were going to be exactly, and how it would tie in with this porch, you know, the screened-in deck. Um, so now that I've got it somewhere, I can go ahead and set some there. Um, well, that's right, I did mention the uh, shelving, or the, the counter type, type shelving. And then I might put some kind of a rail here or maybe something more in the middle so i don't know that part yet but we'll see how inspiration takes us all right that was what it was